Hi everyone, I'm David DeVoe and I'm going to show you guys how to make flower sushi. Okay, let's make the flower sushi roll. Start by taking two half sheets of nori and splitting them into three. So, you just lay them over each other, fold them over into three equal pieces, like so. And now cut them. Now you only need five because you want to make petals out of this. So just throw one away and you've got five equal pieces of nori. You want to make each of the flower petals the same size and weight. So you take about 30 grams, which is one ounce of pink sushi rice. And you place your pink sushi rice in the center, just like that. And then once it's in the center, what you do is just bring in the sides like so and you don't even have to close it. You just have to make one side slightly smaller and this makes that teardrop petal shape which you're looking for. Okay, so now you just make five of these. Okay, so there we go. We've made the five petals. Now you make your carrot cylinder. What you do is you take a rectangle piece of carrot long enough to go all the way through half a sheet of nori like so. And then you just make it into a circle with your knife by scraping off the corners. Beautiful, done. Now you take half a sheet of nori, place it in your hand, and place three of the petals with the pointy bit facing to the inside. And now where they all meet, you put your cylinder of carrot then place the last two so that it perfectly makes a circle which will construct your flower. There we go, beautiful. Okay, now you just seal it round. It will close. If it doesn't close uh, quickly enough, just take three or four kernels of rice and just squash them at the end piece. And this is more like glue, so you just press it there and then you just seal it. Now to assemble the flower sushi roll, you take half a sheet and another half sheet and you glue them together with the aid of a couple of pieces of rice. Just squish them over the edge and this acts as glue. Place it over and this makes a very long piece of nori. You're going to need this for this roll. Now you place it on a bamboo rolling mat and now you want to spread some rice. You don't want to go on an amount of rice, you just want to go more or less what feels right. So make a very thin layer of rice covering about 80% of the sheet. Now what you want to do is make three little walls of rice standing quite close to each other, like so. Okay, that's wall number one. This is wall number two. Okay, beautiful. And then wall number three. Once you've built your walls, sprinkle a little bit of sesame seeds over it. There we go. Now add a couple pieces of nori in between these walls like so. Okay, beautiful. Now in these troughs, what you want to do is just add a little bit of minced strawberries. Don't overfill it. You want to be very, very subtle with this, very little bit. These are like small unopened flowers. And then finish it off with a couple of pieces of very thinly sliced cucumber skin, so that they're very green. Now, you add your flower piece right here. Okay, perfect. And then you just want to seal these up. Close them. Good. And now you add a little Campio package. If you want to know how to make these, check out my other video. A link has just appeared on the left corner, which will take you to Sushi Letters. Okay, so now before you seal it, you add a little bit of rice 
right here in between the campio and the flower. So it's just, so it fills up and it doesn't crinkle up. Okay, and then it's just a question of closing the sushi roll. Okay. There we go. Beautiful. All right, so now dip your knife in some water, just so the rice doesn't stick to it much, and then just simply cut through, revealing the beautiful flower beneath. The campio made a nice stalk of the flower. These are closed flowers still. The green is like the leaves, and then this is the flower. Or you can see what it is. Beautiful. All right, so now just finish the cuts. You should get about three flowers, more or less. And two end pieces, which are not very useful. All right, that was how to make flower sushi. I hope you enjoyed watching this video. If you did, press the like button. And if you're not subscribed, subscribe now on the top left corner. If you want to watch more of my videos, a link is just appeared on the right, which will take you to all my videos. Check them out. Hope you enjoy them. That's all. See you next week.